Tech Source Productions back again with another lame rap. So check it. Welcome to another episode of this crap. It's a show where we open stuff now with a rap. CPUs, GPUs, maybe even penis pills. It gets pretty random, but anything to pay the bills. You gotta chill. Hit that like I'm not a shield. Just needing you bike. This rap is so cringy that it doesn't even rhyme. I'm just a lame nerd trying to buy more time. Gotta make that accent so I can buy another house. Now let me end this bad rap with a random mouse. A huge thanks to World of Warships for sponsoring today's video. World of Warships is a free-to-play online strategy game that's now available on PC and Mac. You can command a massive naval fleet featuring some of history's most iconic war vessels and compete online against other players. As you play the game, you can unlock new ships and dominate the oceans with 30 million players worldwide. The game has beautiful graphics and weather effects make each battle unique and change the tactics of the battle. There are over 200 ships available to play across 7 different nations. My personal favorite is the USS Langley aircraft carrier, which lets you launch fighter planes in the sky to quickly take down enemy ships. The game is really addictive and it's free to play, but if you guys download the game using my link below and use the code on the screen, you will get 1 million credits, a USS Langley aircraft carrier, and 3 days of premium time with other extras. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of What's in the box. I gotta give a huge thanks to everybody who smacked the crap out of the like button on the last video. Guys, again, we hit over 10,000 likes. I love your faces. But anyways, with that said, let's dive right in and unbox some stuff, shall we? We actually have a crap ton of boxes for this episode. Ah, oh, damn it. So the first tiny box is coming from Amazon. You guys already know how it is. Start from the small, work our way up to the top. So let's check this out. Starting off things fairly simple, we have a set of four 120mm fans from Roseville. This is going in a budget build, a highly anticipated $500 budget PC. You guys are gonna see actually the rest of the parts in this video, so it's kind of, it's gonna ruin the surprise, but whatever. This is the best deal you can buy right now on Amazon. $15 for a set of four 120mm fans, which is gonna help with airflow and just overall lower the temps in your PC. Well worth the investment. It's not RGB but it gets the job done for only $15. It's insane. This next box is my favorite box and it's from InSource Mods. So you guys already know what that means. These are the custom cables for Big Red, the rebuild of Big Red. Oh, I always want the best of the best in my own system, so that is why I ordered cables from InSourced Mods. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Uh... I'll open it up for you guys first, actually. That was a bad idea. Beautifully white and red sleeved cables. We even got the uh, the white connector with the white cable combs on here. It's gonna look so damn sexy once the build is complete. Oh, I cannot wait. Huge shout out to Joey from InSource Mods for sending these over. You are the MVP. I cannot wait to put these in the new build. Also, yes guys, my voice does sound different. I am actually currently sick. I do have a cold. So that is why I sound like a dying hippo. So I apologize if I am destroying your ears. Oh, whoa, what's this? Oh, okay, I remember now. I actually got a really good deal on these. Two four gigabyte sticks at 2666 megahertz for 50 bucks. It's gonna fit perfectly within the budget. And we also got a Cloud Stinger headset. Let's actually open this up real quick. This is one of the best budget headphones you can currently buy around the $50 price tag. So uh, I can't really tell you what this is for. You guys are gonna have to wait. I don't wanna ruin the surprise, but it is gonna be a really awesome video for you guys. All right, next up, we've got this box coming from Tool, T-U-L. I have no idea what that is. Ah, wow, this is a, this is a super tiny GPU box. I've never seen a graphics card get shipped into such a small box like this. So this is the RX 570 from PowerColor, the Red Dragon. Not a bad GPU at all. It's gonna kick ass in 1080p, and I think they're actually having a sale on this GPU currently, so it's a lot less on Amazon or UA. I'll drop a link if you guys wanna check it out or pick one up for yourself. But, but yeah, guys, definitely have notifications enabled if you wanna see how this GPU performs in the budget build. All right, let's open this white one over here. This actually has no name or anything on here. 
Actually, I lied. This is from V1 Tech. I, I took out the, uh, the packaging slip. So these are all for the black and green razor themed PC, which I'm also gonna be building a setup for. So we got some black and lime green cable extensions. We got some black and UV green Razer logo fan grills. And are you guys ready for this? Oh, ho, ho, ho. so it's a black GPU backplate, but it's RGB. So the logo over here is actually gonna light up green. It's gonna look sick in the build. And I actually requested a few other things as well. We got RGB SSD covers and an RGB GPU SAG bracket. This is also gonna light up in green. It's gonna be epic. I gotta stop using that word, I'm sorry guys. That's like the only word in my dictionary right now. So, my apologies. Yeah. That could've went really bad, actually. Oh, we have a lot of goodies. Okay. So, first up we've got some speakers from Logitech, the Z200s. This. Did they send me two of these? There's no way I bought two of these. Hold up. I did buy two of these. Ah. Oh. We got a Luxcom soft RGB mouse pad. And we also got... Oh. I buy two of these again. So this is the Aki RGB keyboard. Again, all this is going in a special video. I can't really tell you guys much, but... Ooh, blue switches, okay. So I did a roundup video on the best gaming mice under $20, and this mouse was actually one of the best ones in that video. If you guys missed it, I'll drop a link below, but uh, for $20, this is a solid RGB gaming mouse. I guess I can show you guys the case. I mean, might as well just get it out of the box. So this is the super popular Cooler Master Masterbox Q300L. A really beautiful micro ATX form factor with an acrylic side panel, and it comes pre-installed with a single 120 millimeter fan. A really good looking case for only $40, it's gonna be perfect for the budget build. We actually have two, three more boxes to go actually. Oh, we got some GPUs, boys. And a cooler, we got the Corsair H150i Pro 360mm AIO, and we got some GPUs. The Power Color Red Devil RX 580, and the new, oh, this is the new Radeon 7. I've never, whoa, I gotta open this one up. Let's see, I've actually never got a sample unit, so huge thanks to Power Color for setting this in. Is that an Amazon box? Is that an Amazon box? Oh, it was, okay. Woo -hoo -hoo. Now that I think about it, I've never really done a high-end all AMD build, so I'm definitely gonna find good use for the Radeon 7. Once I'm done with my other water cooling projects, of course, but yeah. Very excited about this. Thank you so much, Power Color, for sending this over. This is awesome. For those of you that don't know, the Radeon 7's gaming performance is between an RTX 2080 and an RTX 2070. One of the biggest issues right now is the pricing. This actually has almost the same price as an RTX 2080. They both go for around $700, sometimes even $750, but the RTX 2080 has better performance than this, so... What they really need to do is lower the price of the Radeon 7, so that's slightly more than the RTX 2070, but a lot less than the 2080. So, Razer actually sent this over yesterday and I unboxed it already, but they sent over some extra gear. Remember I was telling you guys that in the last episode, we got the Razer Nari Wireless Gaming Headset and the new Razer Huntsman Elite Gaming Keyboard. Um, I am actually gonna be doing a giveaway on these three, we got the extra Mamba Elite gaming mouse, another Galatis extended RGB mouse pad, and of course the Black Widow Elite mechanical keyboard that I unboxed in the last episode. These three items are gonna be in a giveaway for the uh, black and green gaming PC that's coming up, I think in a few weeks. So if you guys wanna participate, 
make sure to watch that video. As far as the rest of this gear, it's gonna be going in the epic black and green themed gaming setup that I teased about in the last episode. But yeah, I'm gonna keep these sealed as of now. So many awesome projects coming up, guys. I cannot wait. Okay, last but not least, we have this massive box from Amazon. Okay. This is technically the last piece of the budget build, the H310M from Gigabyte. And we also have a budget 24 inch curved 1080p gaming monitor from Scepter? What is it called? Scepter or Scepter, I don't even know how you say this. 144 hertz, three millisecond response time, AMD FreeSync, and it's a VA panel for only $180. This is one of the best gaming monitors you can buy currently for that price tag. And I know I promised you guys the best gaming monitors but 144 hertz under $20 coming soon, but I had to postpone that for late March. But I am planning on making that video, guys. So yeah, stick around. And that is it for this unboxing episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. As always, leaving a like will let me know to continue doing these on the channel. And as always, leave a dislike if you guys didn't enjoy it. I love your faces. Make sure you subscribe for some epic content coming very soon. I will see you in the next one. Bye.